or K in this uh, video, I will show you a new project we are working on in Stigman. It's called Explode. Um, it's a game engine. So let's open up the um, Stigman. I want to show you um, an example which I made so far. There are not many features in the game engine yet, but the principle is as following. We got um, a certain, we, we have figures you add like a normal stigma, and you can change and use the action. So instead of my name, I want to put explode here. And um, the each figure, when you animate this in an animation, you don't you do something like walking and jumping with the same figure. But in the game engine, you have to have one figure for each action. And um, to make it easier to work with this, we I built um, a checkbox so you can hide. Um, figures you don't need. Um, this is uh, independent of the, the visibility switch, so we can still animate the visibility, but if you want to hide, for example, a background through the entire animation, you can just deselect it here. Um, when, uh, uh, the game engine, we'll, you will find the settings for the game engine under one of these uh, uh, three tools because uh, this is where you choose the output format. So when I play this animation, I see three um, animations, and when I pick this game, and hit space. I will get a new window and it will start the game. So if I press the up button it will jump and if I hold the bu up button in it will keep jumping. So how is this made you might think? Well the first thing is that um, we first have to load a figure and start so then we need to have this load on start yes and when this stops we activate or switch to another figure so the first one disappear and then new one appear so when I go to this one I see uh, it has an interval it defines the start and stop of the animation it is set to repeat it is not holding a start and it will go to another when we hit the up button so we when we are jumping we have not repeating and at the end we go back to the stand animation so stand is the caption of this figure uh, i will see if i can make this easier or something yeah, this is just to make it work but the result is that you are animating like in a normal animation and you connect what the events in animation with another. For example, if I play the animation here is Sigma, I see the text is moving to the right. So I want to expand this animation in the game engine. Okay, so it stops at 65 frames, so I go to one of these tools and um, I can use verbs here 
I want to set the interval to 65 frames and I change back to game and now you see it uh, goes through the whole animation before it continues okay so this is the first demo of the explode and tell me what you think about it you can download the new release of Stefan 5.7 alpha in the link in the description of this video and please subscribe to the channel if you want to follow the development thanks